everyone. So I wanted to show you, I have noticed that some of you have had the opportunity to go on to Lexia, which is the reading program that we'll be using during this distance learning time. Um, and all of it is, is kind of independent. So you have to um, work on it on your own and then that will provide me with your own individual lessons for us to continue to work on during our instructional time or opportunities where I've scheduled other times to work with you or during my office hours, um, if you have any additional questions. So I'm just gonna show you how to log on to it. All of your parents should have received an email that has your login information, but if you don't have that, I'm gonna show you how to log in um, anyway. So what you're gonna do is you're going to go on to lexiacore5.com. So that's lexiacore5.com. And once you hit enter, it's going to bring up this screen here. So the first time you log in, it most likely is going to ask for my email, um, which I'm just gonna type it in. It's arwims at fcps.edu. So if it does ask you for my email, you will be putting that in there for your first time. If you've already logged in, you're already a step ahead of it. So then for your um, username and password. Both of them are your ID number. So that means your username, let's say my ID number is 123456. That means that my password, whatever my username is, is the same as my password. So then my password would then be 123456 as well. Um, now I'm just gonna let you, since I made up that username and password, it's not going to let me log in but when you use yours, it will let you log in. And the first thing you're gonna do is take a placement assessment. That placement assessment will then let me know what level we're at and where we need to continue to work. So I'm just gonna show you a little bit of the features of Lexia and some of the activities um, that it does allow you to do. So what I'm gonna bring up is going to look a little bit different than whenever you log in, um, but just so you can get a little bit of an idea. So is this my name? Yes. All right, so again, the first thing yours is gonna bring up is a placement test. This is just kind of some examples of what each level has. So I'm just gonna go into this level here and so then each one has activities that you would start with. So I'm looking for the suffix, the suffix is Y. So if I'm looking at the suffix in that word, it would be NIS. Il NIS, that one was NIS as well. Oh, let's just say I do that. So it lets you know that it's incorrect and then it goes on to other ones as well. So there's a bunch of different activities. Again, you have to work on this on your own. So I'm just gonna X out of this for now. So you have to work through it on your own. And I'm suggesting that you do 20 minutes per day, at least 20 minutes per day, and you'll really be able to get through those levels. And that will give me some good information on what we need to do with our instruction. If you have any additional questions on Lexia or anything else, please feel free to email me and let me know. I can walk you through it individually so we can get you all set up. Thank you.